MC me, and today I will present to you guys the new Umidigi Bison X10. This is the new hooked phone from Umidigi, so let's check. You can find it in Storm Grey, Supersonic Yellow and Hack Black. The box is yellow and simple, not much information on it. When you open the box, the first thing we can see is the Umidigi Bison X10. In this stick we have some informations. It comes with MediaTek Helio P60, also has a 6.53 inches screen, 20 megapixels main camera and 8 megapixels self camera. It includes IP68, IP69 and military protection. It means water and dust proof. It can also handle falls up to 1.5 meters and low and high temperature. We have customized buttons and it comes with Android 11 system. For now, let's leave this aside. Then we can find a Type C cable and a 10 watts charger. On the right side, we can find the first customized button. They advise you to use this for underwater camera. And you can check the sides, they are made by metal. Then we have the power button. It's also the same button to scan your fingerprint. Above it, we can find the volume buttons. And you can see the ads are reinforced to protect your phone if you drop it. On the top, we only have the 3.5mm jack for earphones. On the left side, we have the trail for dual SIM cards. But if you want, you can use one of these slots to expand your memory. And use a micro SD with maximum 256GB. Next, we have the second customized button. They advise you to use for PTT or SOS, but you can also choose another shortcut. On the bottom, we only have the microphone and the Type-C connector. The back is really pretty and we also have some information here. Yumidigi Bison X10 comes with a triple camera. First, we have a 20 megapixels main sensor. The next one is a 8 megapixels ultra wide. And the last one, we have a 5 megapixels for macro. You can also see three holes on the back. This one is our second microphone. Then we have the pressure relief hole and the last hole is for barometer. Near the sensors we have the flash and in the left bottom we can find the speaker. We will test this later. Let's take out the plastic so we can check it better. In my opinion, this is the most pretty within the rugged phones you Yumidigi released until now. The back material looks like plastic but according to the website it says the material is made by glass fiber. Yumidigi Bison X10 has 279.4 grams. The weight is okay for rugged phones. Mm, now let's try the fingerprint reader. It is not super fast but also not slow. The face scan seems almost the same speed as the fingerprint scan. No, the screen looks good and the colors are vivid and have a good touch response. For the ads, the bottom edge is bigger than the others, but overall is around the same size of all rugged phone's edges. On the top center we have our 8 megapixel self camera and to customize the sides button is really easy. They give you some some options for choose for different actions you do with the buttons, so you can customize three shortcuts for each button. Yumidigi also includes a toolbox with many useful APPs. In this video, I will not be able to test the game performance, but I run the Antutu test and this is the result. For the sound, it's not very loud and it's a little distorted when you put in the maximum volume. And you can check how the sound comes from this speaker on the back. For video quality, you can check this video. This image is clear and colorful. Yumidigi included a nice screen. Now, let's check the camera. First, we have beauty. For this mode, I think they put too much effect on my skin. Please leave in the comment what you guys think. Then we have video and for the video quality, we have maximum full HD. Then we have a photo, portrait and extra. In the extra, you can find night, panel and pro. Let me take some samples, photos and videos for you.
the Bison X10. We are trying the self camera now. You can try to pay attention in the sound and how it re reacts to the light. And let's change to the back camera. If you want to know more about this model, if you want me to do any other tests, please leave in the comments below and uh, I will try to bring this phone again. This is the most simple of the back camera. The phone is trying to find focus, so sometimes it gets confused. You see, I will try to focus in those guys behind. I don't know stability because stability sometimes will change after we put in, in the computer. But uh, for the focus, when it can focus, it become good. But sometimes that one is really get confused. You see, right now the phone don't know if it will focus behind or in the guy in the front. So yeah, that's the result. Here we have our yellow submarine. Yeah, if only have one object in the screen, seems it it, it do a better job, right? What do you think about this new Umidigen Bison X10? Please leave in the comments what do you think about it. And if you had any Umidigen model, please also leave in the comments so we can know if you like this brand or not. If you liked this video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you next time.